What is good, A team? It's your boy T. Hey, bro. Today we are back with yet another food review. I'm sure y'all done probably heard about this by now, but if you couldn't tell from the title, today we are checking out McDonald's new crispy chicken sandwich as well as the spicy chicken sandwich. Now I haven't tried either one of them. I've seen a lot of people dropping reviews off and all that. I was I didn't know if it was actually a new one or not because I think it was around last week. Um, I actually checked on the via app and they had three new sandwiches on there. You feel me? It was a deluxe, a regular, and a spicy, but they also had a little advertisement that said coming soon. So I'm like, is it out? Is it not? You feel me? But either way, just open the app up today and I guess it officially came out either today or yesterday because um, they got the promotion for it on the actual app itself. And I wanted to do a McDonald's versus Burger King, but the Burger Kings I'm near don't have their new hand breaded crispy chicken sandwich yet, so I can't do it, you feel me? So I figured I'll just come with this McDonald's one, get the ball rolling a little bit, and once the Burger King sandwich officially drops, then I'll come with a versus video for the McDonald's versus the Burger King, you feel me? Now, originally, I was planning on getting the original and adding bacon to it, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to just get both of them how they come. Probably get a couple dipping sauces on the side um, just in case I need them because I don't think either of them come with like mayo or anything. So they might be a little bit dry. Hopefully not, but they might be. You feel me? But either way, uh, I'm doing a little bit too much talking. Timestamps will be down in the description if y'all want to skip up to the review itself. Um, but I suggest you stick around. You feel me? i to go ahead and check this out. I think I'm going to order it when I get there because I want it to be as like hot as possible. So I'm going to just go to the drive through and order it like that instead of through the app. So either way, bro, I'll catch y'all when we get there. Luckily, we have nobody in line. It's 1230. I did not expect this. Oh, so they got some. Ah, Chicken Sandwich. the spicy crispy and deluxe. Welcome to McDonald's. How can I help you today? Uh, can I try the or get a uh, one of the regular crispy chicken sandwiches and one of the the spicy? Okay. Anything else for you? No, man. That'll be all. Can I have the eleven eighty first one, All right. Thank you. Can't do it. Can't do it. Here's what I'm about to do. I'm about to park. Hold on, bro. I'm about to get y'all right. All right, bro. Now, like I said, I wanted to order it through the drive-thru because I figured that would be the, the way to get the sandwiches as fresh as possible. But she playing games. She just said 11 and some change, bro. Y'all heard it. 11 and some change. Where, Sway? I ain't, even about to, I ain't even about to ask you about none of that. You feel me? After the tax, we should be at 979, my baby. You feel me? We at McDonald's. I ain't... <laughs> Come on, bruh. That's tough. Maybe she knew. Maybe she just run me up for the same. But I know the, the spicy. Are they not the same price? Or are they? It's a little bit extra. It's 50 cent extra or 60 cent extra for the spicy. Um, I don't know where, where they math was coming from. But either way, I'm about to order it through the app. And I'm going to just have to pick it up like that. But y'all see the total right here. That's for one spicy and one crispy. $9.79 after tax. Um, but I'm about to go ahead and place this order, pull up in one of these spots, and wait on them to bring it out, bro. I'll catch y'all in a second. Now, this is one thing I can say I do like about McDonald's, uh, the mobile ordering, is that you can pull up and they'll have, they have like four to five, maybe even six different uh, spots for you to pull up in for your curbside pickup. Kind of similar if uh, if y'all ever ordered through Chick-fil-A's app, it's kind of similar to two of that to an extent, but... Finish. What? Y'all see, bruh? <laughs> yeah, hold on, bruh. Hold on, bruh. So I just did all that to try and save a dollar or like two dollars, right? I ordered on the app. It says it was nine and some change. As soon as I go to place the order, your total has been updated to twelve and some change. I go to review. It says twelve twenty three after tax. So essentially, I should have just ordered. I'm just about to go inside and order this. I will catch y'all when I get back in the car with my sandwiches, bruh. 
It's tough. All right, y'all. So it did take about 10, eh, maybe 12 minutes to get this, even though, I, I mean, I went inside, there was nobody in there, but they looked like they were kind of backed up. It was like, it was, I guess, at least five to six cars in a drive through after I walked in and almost every person was ordering a crispy chicken sandwich. That's what happens when you when you drop something new, bro, and you're a, a nationwide chain, you feel me? But either way, we got the sandwiches. Uh, we about to head back, get our little setup together. We're going to break this down for y'all, you feel me? Catch y'all in a second. We're going to talk about how all these different totals and all. We're going to talk about that once we get set up. I'll catch y'all in a second. to do with me you feel me that thing just gonna have to ring off the hook at this rate my boy that's tough um but hey man we got the chicken sandwiches here let me go ahead and get this thumbnail together we gonna go with one of the <laughs> something like that for the thumbnail i don't know bro but as y'all see, they got the Brandon for the spicy or for the crispy chicken sandwiches on the bag itself. Um, I didn't get no sauces, bro. I really forgot about that. Now switch the audio up. Your boy just got a new microphone in. So this might give y'all a little bit of extra ASMR type of action. You feel me? But of course you see there, got the spicy. Got the regular right there. We definitely starting it off with the regular. For sure. I ain't gonna lie to you, this the smell on this gives me a Chick-fil-A vibe. I ain't saying it's Chick-fil-A, but the smell on it for sure give me a Chick-fil-A vibe. Alright. Here's what we working with, y'all. That bun, I think that that might be brioche. That thing looking right though. Nothing on it. A little bit of smoke coming up off of it though. So that thing still, well hopefully y'all can see that, but that is definitely a little bit of smoke coming up off this thing. So it's still hot. Got your two pickles right there, nothing too crazy. This for sure should have had some sort of toppings on it, but I guess that's why they had the deluxe version. But either way, bro. <clears throat> Really ain't too much to, well, first of all, we do have something to talk about. McDonald's. Why did I first go on your app? Y'all seen it. It said $9 and some change after tax. Cause I went to the drive-thru, of course it came up to 11, right? Then I look on my app, it say $9 and some change. I'm like, okay, let me just order it through the app. Then I go to order it. Your order has been updated uh, to this, this, and that. Go to that, the total's now $12 and some change. So first, how do I go to your app and it's $9? I go to the drive-thru, it's $11. No, 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 let me let me rewind. We went to the drive-thru, it was $11 and some change. I go to the app, it says $9. I go to place the order, it updates to $12. I go inside, it's back to 11 and some change. How is your tax all, like how how is how are the prices all over the place like that? That's all I'm trying to figure out, you feel me? But either way, let me give y'all a little look at that up close. I mean, it ain't really too much going on. The bottom button literally has nothing on it. So that's all you got there. Well, let's go ahead and take a bite of this. It's still hot. Oh, my. McDonald's. Are you serious? Now, first of all, let me, I ain't show y'all how much my stuff came up to. And I already blessed over my food before I even started recording. So it came up to 1180. So essentially you get one of these sandwiches is going to be 590. Essentially, but they still charge me. I don't understand because on the app it says the spicy is 60 cent more. 
it was supposed to be like four dollars and then four dollars and sixty nine cents. But on here, on here it's a five twenty nine per sandwich. So they both the same exact price. I don't understand that really. I don't know why on the app it said four and some change and I was saying matter of fact, let me check back on the app real quick. Okay, so now on the app it says five twenty nine. Okay. Okay. It is what it is, bro. Either way. Hmm. Bro, I should have added bacon, but this chicken, bro. It definitely ain't your, ain't your run of the mill mick chicken type of chicken. You feel me? I hope y'all can see that smoke coming because I can still see that mess falling up off of it. This is good chicken. I don't want to fill myself up too much on that. Just yet, we about to go with the spicy though. Let's see what the heck this is talking about. I know it got some sort of spicy sauce on it. Let's see. Okay, so it comes with crinkle cut pickles, spicy pepper sauce. So the only difference is the spicy pepper sauce on there. Let me show y'all that up front. A little bit of that sauce coming on. Whoa. So you got your two pickles on there. You got your sauce. Pretty sure on the bottom they just added more sauce. Yeah. That's all we got there. Mm. That spice to me is low key hidden. <clears throat> you feel me? Hidden like it's spicy. To me, I don't eat spicy foods like that. So maybe, maybe that's just me personally. But this type of spicy sauce, I feel like would be would pair well with some ranch just to kind of offset it a little bit. The most as far as spicy that I eat is like Frank's red hot sauce on some fish or something like that. You feel me? That's just me, though. I like the original over this with the sauce. But if I had some ranch to dip this in, I feel like this would be. This would go crazy too. I know there's a lot of people who probably like, bro, this ain't even spicy to me. You feel I don't eat spicy foods like that. Yeah. <clears throat> if I had to choose between either one of these, I'm going with the regular off top. Let's go back. This is the regular. Spicy sitting over there. Now for the ones out there <clears throat> who's saying that the spicy is not that spicy, that's how you know I don't eat spicy foods that much. The spicy is still tingling in my mouth, almost to the point where it's messing up the regular <laughs> chicken sandwich for me, you feel me? I don't even know if I want to eat this spicy, though. I should have got some ranch, bro. Like the spicy ain't bad. And I know for the ones out there who might, who like spicy food more than I do, you probably, you probably rocking with that, you feel me? For me, like I said, some ranch would definitely offset this well, but it's still that, that tingle in my mouth from the spicy sauce, pause. But that, that little after feeling of the spices I don't know how I 
I feel about it. Like I said, bro. If y'all want, <clears throat> if y'all want to see me do a review of this crispy chicken with bacon added, just let me know. But if not, the next review we coming with is gonna be the Burger King crispy chicken versus the McDonald's. <clears throat> now I've seen at least 10, 10 different channels on YouTube do a review. To the new Burger King crisp, hand breaded crispy chicken sandwich. And I heard that Burger King was discontinuing all their other ones, all their other crispy chicken sandwiches, which I pulled up to my nearest Burger King last night, trying to see if I can order the hand or if they had the hand breaded crispy chicken. They said no. I called the another one that was a little further than the one that's closest to my house. They said, well, uh, we. First, she said we don't have it in, but then she changed it. Like, well, I mean, we just basically we got to get trained on how to make it first. When is it coming out, my baby? That's all. I, it sounds like y'all got the all the ingredients already there. Y'all just ain't been trained on how to make it. But like I said, I've seen at least ten different food reviewers drop videos on the Burger King crispy chicken sandwich. So hopefully, it'll be out here soon. We gonna see when it does drop. We definitely coming with a regular versus regular. I might do a spicy versus spicy too, but for sure I'm doing the regular McDonald's versus the regular Burger King crispy chicken. <clears throat> hey, if you're still here watching the video, I appreciate you. Um, <clears throat> off the first two bites of this, when I say this, this really gave me a a semi Chick Fil A vibe. I ain't gonna say it was fully Chick Fil A, but a semi Chick Fil A vibe, just with the chicken itself. Like, but I'll be honest with y'all, I do think that Burger King's. Hand breaded crispy chicken is going to be better, e e even better than this was. But I would definitely recommend y'all check this out if y'all haven't. Like I said, I think it's almost about six dollars um, for one sandwich, so that is a because some people could get a five dollar meal deal. You feel me? Where you get fries and a drink. This is just six dollars for the sandwich itself. Is that worth it? Mm. It's okay, you feel me? If you just had the extra dollar to spend and you want to get your fries and drink separate, go ahead and do what you do. I would still say try it out at least once, though. Man. That is a good piece of chicken, though. Spicy one. Had too much spice for me personally, but <clears throat> I know somebody out there will like it. Like I said, for me personally, I'm going with that regular crispy chicken sandwich over the spicy the deluxe really what is the deluxe it's the regular chicken sandwich just added lettuce tomato and mayo i mean what are we talking about here you feel me <clears throat> i really should have added bacon though just to see how that how that would have been but like i said if y'all want to see that review just drop it down there in the comments y'all see my thoughts on it though like i said if you like the spicy i would say try the spicy out but for me personally the flavor itself was was like more apparent on that regular crispy chicken the spicy one for me at least kind of over the like the the, the spicy sauce the spicy pepper sauce itself kind of overpowered the flavor of the chicken if i'm being honest but that's just me I need y'all to get down there in the comments though definitely let me know what y'all thought about the review
If y'all tried this out already, either one of these, get down there in the comments and let me know what y'all think about it. I definitely want to hear y'all thoughts on it. And if y'all want to see that Burger King head hand breaded crispy chicken versus the McDonald's crispy chicken, whenever it drops in my area, let me know in the comments and I'll definitely come with that review for y'all. But hey, man, I hope y'all enjoyed it. We on the road to 20K subscribers, 18. I appreciate all the love y'all been showing so far. Let's keep it going, keep it growing. And like I always say, y'all keep coming back, tuning in. I'm going to keep these videos rolling out. We're going to keep getting it lit over here. Catch y'all on the next video.